Okay, hey, it's like 11.49 at night, and, um, yeah, I just have a few updates, and, no, I can't, I can't, this is not a, this is not a cute place, this is not a cute place, okay, pause for station identification, pausing for station identification, station JJ, Okay, hi. Hi, I'm back. Um, so first of all, just off the bat, just because anybody's interested, I got my headphones, right? I was telling you, I was like, oh, I was so disappointed, and I thought they were Bluetooth in the last video. I was like, oh my god, they're Bluetooth, but they're not. Anywho, um, I got the cord. It's really cute. It's red. It has like buttons, and it's a little microphone. So blah blah. blah. Hey, girl. Anyways, um, so the other night I went to a play and it was so good. It was so good. It's called Where the Blood Mixes. Ooh, and it's written by, um, Kevin, I'll put this description in the sidebar, but it was really good. And, um, I can't believe, like, it was so well done and, um, what an epic storyline, and what I think it's pretty freaking amazing that it got done in the way it did, too. And the actors are pretty freaking amazing. If you want my personal opinion, okay. Um, it's really heavy, though. Like, it's not like, you know, oh, uh, feel good. It's, it's pretty heavy. I, I, it was pretty intense. I, I, um, yeah. But if you're in Victoria from when's the from January nineteenth to February twenty first, two thousand ten, it's at the Belfry Theater, and it's so good. And like you just if you're in Victoria and you get a chance to see it, I highly recommend this. Um, like I said, it's pretty like emotionally um charged, and um, yeah, it's I'll give you kind of a little. I don't know if they do a plot somewhere in here. I don't think they do. Yeah, it's, um... Essentially what it is, is, um, this uh, Aboriginal, um, lady gets, uh, apprehended from the ministry when she's, like, younger, and she doesn't have a lot of memories of home, and she goes to find her father who is a residential school survivor and it kind of goes to her journey and his journey through discovering that in each other and all that jazz so like i said i really recommend you going to see this yet again it's such a i don't know if you can see this or not i'm not good but yeah um i think it's very vital because i think it sheds a lot of light on um, certain issues in my communities, and, um, it's very relatable, it's a very relatable story, if you're not, even if you're not Aboriginal, it's, go see it. So, yeah, um, I hope I'll post a vid again soon. Ooh, so is hot.